up you guys so I know it's been a while but today marks the 10 day countdown for when Chris will be here and I'm very excited I can't say much of what I want to say because he is on the phone but you literally just mute me yeah but what's the fun in that <laughs> anyway so yeah 10 days. I am stressed. I am excited. I will be off work for two weeks. Thank God. I have exams this week and into next week. Even though it's only like 10 days. I don't know how that works out. But anywho, yeah. So there's going to be a lot in these 10 days that has to get done before he gets here. That way I have everything submitted for nursing. And then I get my new schedule and blah, 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 blah. But anyway. So he's here in 10 days. I'm picking him up Friday night. Well, not this Friday, but next Friday. And I'm very, very excited and very happy because he gets to meet all my family. My family wants to meet him. There's a couple of things that I do want to take him around here to do, which I'm not going to say all of them because, but yeah. And then I got him a couple of gifts that I may or may not show you right now. I can't, but we'll see. I'm just really excited and I can't wait to have him here and just scout the area for a little bit and stuff. So we'll see where it goes and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. You just messed up my intro. You really just messed up my intro. Yeah, no, this is what I deal with. On a daily basis, and oh, um, you deal with me. <laughs> and as you guys saw from the earlier video that I took, a little sneak peek thing. But yeah, so today marks five days. Oh my, like, really super duper excited! I know my face doesn't really show it right now, and I know I look like really tired and, ugh, but I just came. Ah, blah, blah, blah. I haven't done shit. That was all her. That was all her. She looked over at me like trying to blame my ass. Uh, I wasn't even looking at you. Anywho, I just got home Trust from... Trust me, people. It's true. Anywho, I, um, I had just got home from work maybe about a couple minutes ago and trying to unwind. I have exams tomorrow my last day of work tuesday and then another exam wednesday thursday before i pick him up on friday you're so, gonna kill it guys why thank you baby um i have to study for that exam which is like a huge big binder full but no so five days till he is here which i am super excited about he gets to meet my family stay with me and all that good stuff as you can see i have clothing options that are hanging up on be closet either a red dress or a black dress I don't know yet depends on how I'm feeling that day I'm also going to the salon that day before to get my hair done it's gotta you already look Spanish <laughs> you're get... gorgeous just look at that girl look at that girl she beautiful and she knows she loves me she loves me can you stop I love you, I love you too can you stop please <laughs> um yeah, so I'm going to get my hair cut and all that. I do have a couple of his gifts and something else that I am giving him that means a lot to me. But hence because I'm always on the phone with him, which is a very good thing. Don't, don't get that cross. It's a good thing. But I can't show you because he's on the phone with him. Well, actually, I can pause. No, 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 no. I'm going to pause you. That way, yeah. I'll just play a game of Fortnite while I wait. You and your Fortnite. <laughs> he always plays Fortnite. It's like the most annoying. Not annoying, but sometimes it's like, I want to. Huh? I don't know. Anyway, sometimes like I want to be able to have the attention all on me because I'm a little bit of attention on it. But anyway, so these are a couple. Actually, let me mute him real quick. Or mute myself. Now you can't hear me. I can't hear a word she's saying, guys. No, he can't. Because they're all surprises. That's good. There's a couple more things, but I'm not going to show you guys those. These are just some little basic things. 
Okay, so one of his thing is always with charging. So I ended up getting him, yeah, sales market or advertising or whatever. I ended up getting him a nice little battery pack thing that's like five times the charge and holds a lot, which I was going to get one myself, but I never did. And he's into working out. He loves running and working out and just doing that to make him happy. And now I'm muted. That makes me curious. But um, I got him wireless headphones that are for working out. So they're like sweat proof and semi water, not waterproof, but water resistant to help out. And instead of it where it's in your pants pocket, it's like dangling all the time and you feel it when you run that's in your pants pocket. I got him an arm grip that is also waterproof and sweat proof for when it's raining, if you're running in the rain, if you do that kind of thing. And then he's always going through phone cases and I love the color of his phone and I know he loves it and I know he likes the color red. So I got him this clear phone case to do and then I got him this one which I know he loves, and I mean loves dragons, and I know he likes the colors black and gold, as you can tell from the watches that I got him previously. So I did get him this case, which I fell in love with. Everyone in my family loves it. Like, I want it, but no one has the phone to fit it, so no one got it, but I wouldn't do that anyway. I do have one other gift that is actually right over there on my mantle but that is something that I am not going to show you guys that is the one thing that means a lot to me so if we do do a reveal or video on that itself maybe possibly but no I'm just super excited for him to come I get to pick him up Friday and he's going to be here for two weeks and I'm going to be off for two weeks and relaxing and I honestly just can't wait at all for him to be here because it means a lot to me and four months has honestly been way too long. I don't like that it's four months because of what my schooling but I know that me and him are going to try to work some things out to where we can see each other more often. Maybe like every two months to even just do like a quick three-day, two-day weekend thing to be able to see each other because four months without being able to really see each other kind of sucks. Don't you agree? Uh, yeah, it sucks majorly, guys, and uh, it just it takes a lot out of the relationship. Like, I don't love her any less. Actually, I love her more because I do this, trust me. Yeah. Uh, but it, it it just, we, we, we need to do something other than two weeks. The problem is her schooling and figuring out the logistics of it because they don't tell her anything until, like, she gets her new schedule, so we can't work anything out until we get that Which, new schedule. Speaking of a new schedule, I'm waiting on a confirmation because I have this one group of girls that I go to school with that every day we stay to school from like what, 11 o'clock in the morning to like what, sometimes 8 o'clock at night doing schoolwork? Yeah. And yep. I don't have class with them. I have the class before them and they have class after, so I'm trying to get my schedule Wait, you switched around. No, I told you I have it at 9 o'clock and they have it at 11. I'm trying to get switched to 11. Oh, you're talking about... You're talking about I, I my you're new talking classes. About no, my yeah. new classes. I'm about to say, I was like, wait, what? <laughs> no, so we're getting switched around with that, trying to figure out that, so I'll hear about that tomorrow. But, no, four months, it's, it's hard because you want to see each other and you necessarily can't. And sometimes it causes a little bit of strain, like, well... Like, sh by strain, meaning, like, we'll get easily agitated sometimes. Or... Yeah, no, he gets easily agitated. So do you, grumpy pants. <laughs> I get agitated when she gets agitated, but she's still cute. <laughs> but, yeah, no. But anyway, so, five days. That's ten days. Five days. I, that was like, okay, five fingers, don't motion thing okay <laughs> but anyway this video is getting way too long so you guys will have one on friday of the day up and i guess we'll see you soon in more videos possibly probably yeah i'll be i'll be vlogging she we got her 10 day countdown the mine coming up so she might be in mine too all right guys have a good one hey guys so i didn't do one before I left the house because I was really, really busy 
with getting a couple things set up, especially because we are having a barbecue tomorrow uh, with the whole family. Chris is going to meet them. We're going to hang out by the pool, have some fun, eat some really, really good food. Anywho, so um, Chris is going to be going to the airport soon. I am driving to the salon to get my hair done. Now, I didn't tell him what I was getting done. I told him I'm just getting a conditioning treatment and my hair getting cut because it's, it's really long. It's so beautiful. Anyway, um, that's not what I'm doing. I'm keeping my dark roots, but the rest is like going blonde and maybe leaving in some regular color, but I'm going blonde. I actually, yes, did my makeup today as you guys can see. It looks good, flawless, on point. Anywho, yeah, so I'm excited. I woke up at seven in the morning and I really couldn't go back to sleep. So I just laid in bed, like wishing for sleep because I was kind of passing in and out on Chris last night. So I felt a little bad. Um, sorry guys, I'm just, I'm driving at the moment. That's why you can see steering wheel. But um, no, so I'm really excited. If the weather holds up tonight, I wanna take him to one place that means a lot to me after I pick him up from the airport, but we will see what happens. And then of course I will show you guys everything after it's done. I have about maybe a two hour drive, considering the traffic is normally it's like an hour and a half and there is a cop radar right now. I hate cops. I love cops. Look, okay, let me get this straight. I love cops because um, my family is close with them. But, I hate when they radar because I don't want to get a speeding ticket because sometimes I'm a little heavy on the pedal. Anywho, but yeah, no. So I'm really excited. I've been jonesing. I've been getting up at like 6, 7 o'clock in the morning lately, every single morning, like for the past five days because I've been so excited. My body's just like, yeah, wake up. You got a lot to do. Yesterday, I spent the whole entire day cleaning. I cleaned the house from top to bottom, inside and out. I cleaned out the patio. I cleaned the pool. And we, uh, my Aunt Shelly and I... My aunt Shelly and I, ugh, uh, we set up the pool area a little bit better. We bought some tiki lights, which I always wanted to do. And I told her, I was like, I really want to buy tiki lights for the pool area. She's like, well, let's go do it. So we did that last night, filled, filled them up with the mosquito stuff this morning. But no, I'm excited for tomorrow, for everyone to have a barbecue, just be nice, relaxed, hang by the pool. The weather's supposed to be really nice. And we're also going to be talking about a family vacation on which, depending on when, if Chris can do it, he will be coming with. So I'm excited about that. We're talking about that Saturday, so he's here, so we can all talk about it. So I'm just, I'm really excited. And yes, I did, I painted my nails because nursing school, Oof, I can't have anything. But speaking of nursing school, I passed all my exams. I am super duper happy with that. I have four classes this coming semester and it's not gonna be too bad. They look okay, but we will see. But anyway, I will talk to you guys later and see you soon. Hey, what's up you guys? So I just got out of the salon. Chris went on board his plane maybe about uh, a couple minutes ago. Well, maybe like a half hour. So this is what I did. I kind of went blonde. <laughs> it's something that I've always wanted to do. Chris loved it because when my hair is naturally curly, it looks like Shakira's curls. And one thing I've always loved about Shakira is the dark roots and the lighter hair. So that is what I hence did. I can give you guys, or Chris can put up a selfie or whatever later. But this is this, so now I am getting gas. And then I'm gonna be going to the airport to go pick him up, which I am super duper stoked. But first things first, I have to get gas, because if not, uh, it's not gonna be too well. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm actually about to turn into the gas station now, so. I'm excited and it was so good seeing Miss Love again. She's done my hair since I was, oh God knows, maybe like 11 years old, just about. So it was really nice for her to, to do it. But yeah, so I'm excited. I gotta do Big Huey if I'm able to get this one. But no, so I'm happy. I'm very, 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 very happy and excited because Chris will be here and there we go but so this looks good miss miss love did a good job but anyway i gotta go guys and you'll be seeing more soon bye